hello again so in today's video i am going to be showing bathing suits again and a couple of shorts at the end all right so my measurements are 48 inches at the bust 41 inches at the waist and 45 inches at the hips i am just under five feet tall in this haul i am going to tell you my bra measurements because you might want to know them and i normally wear a 42 double d that is my bra size I purchased all of these items in a size 2XL, Shein 2XL, which is equivalent to a US size 16, which I am. I am a US size 16. And okay, so now let me begin with the first item. So <laughs> the first item is this one right here. So this is a one piece bathing suit and it looks exactly like this. I absolutely love this bathing suit like I feel that it just cinches you in like so well it feels like it was like um, like control undergarment the top is so super cute like I love this you could take this off by the way I'm, I'm gonna be showing you that in the video that you could take this little thingy off and then it just like creates a bigger space so it covers you a little bit more or you could keep it on and it gives you a little bit more like of a cleavage then it does have adjustable straps like of course it has adjustable straps <laughs> you cannot take them off by the way um and the back is like has piping like contrast piping all around the front does too um the middle has it as well but just in the front not the back so it is like this it covers pretty well at the booty um, another thing that I was going to tell you is that I am wearing gray underwear like underneath everything because I had an incident where um, I think my private my private parts showed when I was like trying on the bathing suit so I decided that after that that I'm going to wear underwear underneath. This time I think it's the only time that I feel a little bit more comfortable like wearing um, showing you like the bottom part of the bathing suit. And it's because I've been exercising. Like, oh my gosh, I've been exercising a lot. Not only like am I exercising, but I've been trying to eat very healthy um, for the past few months. So I've lost like a total of 10 pounds. And yeah, I'm like, I'm seeing, I'm seeing a difference. All right. The next bathing suit is this one right here. And when I saw this bathing suit, I was like, I need to have this. Like I love tie-dye and I love pink and I love that pink and black and that little bit of yellow that it has and it even has a little bit of blue like I love this bathing suit so um yeah definitely now I'm probably gonna be wearing these bathing suits with a with a swim skirt like a black swim skirt so it I'm not gonna be wearing them like I'm showing them to you right now this one right here has rouging like this thing right here that you pull on the side and then it makes it more ruched or you could pull it out and then it's not ruched anymore. When you pull it, it creates ruching in the front a little bit. So it makes the leg opening be higher. So it's gonna show more leg and more hip, but it will also create a little bit of um, ruching in the front. So it kind of like, uh, it doesn't hide your belly, but it does kind of like, it helps to like make it look a little bit better anyways so um this one is completely completely lined like the inside of it is completely lined with this white fabric and the back is crisscrossed the back is crisscrossed and it is adjustable straps it does have adjustable straps i also love the this style right here it's kind of like a v-neck but it's not like a very pointy v-neck it's more like a soft v i would say and i think that that looks so cute like the cleavage it makes the cleavage look really really cute all right so um this one right here is also lined i forgot to tell you but this black one is also completely lined in black fabric um Okay, the other thing about these bathing suits is that they all bring these inserts for the boobs. They are very weird. 
like I have to take them out on all of them because it just creates like this in, like round impression like when you're wearing them it looks really strange it looks like you have balonies on your like on your breast so no I don't like that all right and they're puffy so <laughs> it's like puffy balonies all right, the next bathing suit is this one right here, and it is also a one piece, just like the previous two. But this one has a cutout in the center, like on the belly. So the back looks like this. It's a scoop neck in the back. Obviously, it doesn't have adjustable straps because it's a scoop neck. And um, orange and pink. I love the combination of orange and pink. I've always loved that. And I love that the pink is closer to the face because I love how I look in pink. <laughs> Anyways, um, so it, it's a little more covered at the chest area. It, there's like no cleavage, I think, because it kind of goes a little bit higher up. It does have this cutout at the belly and it has this little knot right here. So I love this bathing suit. Like it is completely, completely lined. Like everything is lined in this white fabric. It covers a little bit more than the rest, except that it does have that opening in the front. So, you know, it's up to you if you like to have that opening or not. So love that. Love that bathing suit. Okay. The next bathing suit that I am going to show you is this one right here. And I am still not sure if I'm going to be showing you the whole video of this uh, when I tried it on because it is tiny. It is tiny okay so it is a triangle top bikini so it's a three-piece set it brings the triangle top it brings the bikini and it i guess it would be like kind of like a full coverage sort of bikini i guess they're just bottoms regular bottoms <laughs> and it brings this thing right here so you're going to see this in the video because it's kind of hard to explain it to you. But um, let me start off with the bottoms. They're not high waisted. They're not high waisted. Um, they reach up to my waist. So um, yeah, not high waisted at all. They are completely lined. They're a 2XL, like I said before, completely lined. Very cute bottoms. The reason why I bought this bathing suit is because I... I'm planning on either making a red swim skirt or buying one already made, which I can't find one that I like. So I think I'm going to just make it um, and I'm going to make it according to how my other swim skirt looks because I do so. <laughs> All right. So the top, the top. <laughs> okay. So the top is basically a triangle top, but and that's the reason why I gave you my bra measurements. I'm a 42 double D and my boobs, that, no, they don't fit in here. Like they just don't fit in here. Um, it does have like the same things in the inside, but it does have a little opening right here that you could take them out. Um, all of the bathing suits have that little opening and they're usually on the side where you could take out the insert. So that's good. Um, this does not cover my boobs and I don't think it's supposed to cover like your boobs completely like I feel like there's some girls that just wear it where part of their boob pops out on the side here and the other one right here but on me my boobs come out at the center at the side at the bottom I know that if I jump they're gonna fall out like it's there's no question about it I mean it barely covers my areola it's just yeah it's tiny but this is meant to be worn underneath this right here. And this right here, it's like a little cover, kind of like a little jacket sort of thing that goes like on top of the bathing suit. You're gonna see in the video, but yeah, it does. It's just like a tiny little bolero top sort of thing. And then you, you have like these really long, long strings that you just like wrap around yourself. Um, so yeah, this is really cute. And I mean, honestly, I would have bought this, I would have bought this thing by itself. If they would sell it by itself, I would have bought it by itself. Um, because I absolutely love this little thing. This one has, um, strawberries. It's mesh, by the way. This is mesh. It's very stretchy. 
it does have searching like it's searched all around um and it has the strawberries they do have it in peaches as well and i believe they have it like in lemons and oranges and kind of stuff like that um, but they do have different fruit and but they're in different colors um what can i say i think that i will be wearing it definitely um I, like i said i'm gonna go on vacation later on this year and i think that if i lose a little bit more weight and i'm not uncomfortable showing my belly then i definitely will be wearing this and um, i'll be wearing it with the swim skirt though i won't be wearing it like that like i just i'm not comfortable wearing just like regular bottoms especially when it's just like when it's just like a piece of underwear like i'm uncomfortable but everyone feels different so if you like that kind of stuff then this is perfect like it's such a cute little outfit i also think that it will look so cute if you're wearing like a red one piece bathing suit and then you just put that on top it's super cute and i actually saw some girls wearing this in the pictures on the Shein website with like a regular top like to go out like not even like as a swimsuit like they were just wearing it like a little jacket and it actually looks cute it depends what you wear it with okay the next thing that i have is this cover-up and it's a swimsuit cover-up i was looking for another swimsuit cover-up because i do have another one that i purchased on shein but it has sleeves and i was looking for something that's sleeveless and that it's cotton because when you're at the beach and it's really hot you want something that is more natural like the fabric is more natural so that it doesn't get too hot so i got this one that is like crocheted and this is what it looks like the only thing i don't like about this is that it has no shape it's just a rectangle that's what it is you know and i wish that it would have had like a little bit more like uh, a, a more like hourglass kind of appearance or something where you could gather it a little bit under the bus so that it kind of sent you in a little bit and then it went out because this doesn't doesn't do me any favors you know and this shape it does have buttons so i feel like these buttons don't go at all with this bait with this cover up like they're just like white pearls with like gold around them like they look so vintage when this is not that <laughs> so i don't know but i mean you could always switch out the buttons i don't think they're holding anything i think they're just decorations um so you could always take them off and not have anything at all or you could put other buttons um, whatever you want but yeah this is what it looks like it's really cute it's super soft like it's crochet it's like cotton um like cotton yarn you know so it's very nice all right the next two items um i are these right here okay so they're shorts and let me just tell you why i got these shorts first before like you see them because I bought these shorts because whenever I wear dresses, like when I go to church, I wear dresses and, or I wear a skirt. And I always like to wear like um, shorts underneath. So usually I'm wearing my pajama shorts underneath my dresses. So I wanted to get something that was a little more um, my skin tone to wear underneath stuff so you can't see it because I usually wear my like black and red checkered buffalo print shorts that are like pajama shorts underneath a dress and that's not the best idea if you're wearing something that's a little bit lighter because it's going to show through so i decided to get shorts so i got two i got one that's a little more bulky like a regular short but it's still soft and i got one that's like a biker short so this is the biker short it looks absolutely horrible on me but i mean nobody's gonna see it but even though nobody's gonna see it like i feel like these shorts are not it like it fits great at the waist um it is my regular she in size 2xl so um it does fit great at the waist but then like everything else um it is way too big on me so um i feel like these are made for someone with a smaller waist and bigger hips bigger legs not for my body shape um so yeah it doesn't look the best on me 
I don't know what I'm going to do if I'm just going to give them away or if I'm going to see if I could just like um, take the fabric and remake them because the fabric I think is great for wearing underneath clothing. Kind of like a slip. I guess like slip shorts. Is that what I'm trying to say? Yeah. Um, as biker shorts though, like I feel like especially if they're supposed to they're meant to be a little bit like very fitted to your body i feel like this will be kind of a little bit see-through see if you pull on it you can see through it all right the other thing that i bought is this one right here and these shorts i'm sorry they're so wrinkled like i didn't feel like ironing so um <laughs> it's what it, i hate ironing all right so um it's these right here they have a nice sturdy waistband they're so soft like this fabric honestly is very soft uh, i bought them because i'm going to be wearing them under dresses so this right here this drawstring doesn't pull on anything it's just decoration so i will definitely be taking that off so i could wear this under my dresses and not have that thing right there okay so yeah these shorts are very comfortable and if you like this color i think that that's great for like going out i mean that's what they're for <laughs> the fabric on these shorts it feels kind of like a little bit like rayon i don't know what kind of fabric it is but i'll write it down somewhere all right so that is all i have for you today I hope you enjoyed this haul. It was a little bit different from what I usually buy. Let me know down in the comments below which one was your favorite. Depending on whether I felt comfortable watching the video back or not, I will have put the whole bathing suit or I'm just gonna show parts of it because I'm still a little bit self-conscious, especially like my middle, like my um, inner thighs. Like I feel they're, it's not that they're flabby. I feel like with age, they have started to sag a little bit. You know, I have to work on that. I'm looking for workouts online to like firm up that area. But I am sure I'm not the only one that feels self-conscious of certain things. And you might have that and feel completely confident. More power to you. I wish I was like you. <laughs> so anyways, um, that is all I have for you today. So thanks for watching. Have a great day and stay safe out there. Bye.